This is a prototype of a electronic expansion valve controller designed to optimize the superheat in a refrigerant system using a R134A refrigerant. The hardware is a PIC microcontroller 16F688. The two potentiometers on the prototype board are used to simulate the evaporator exit pressure and evaporator exit temperature. The board here is used to uh, drive the stepper motor based on commands from the PIC microcontroller. It implements micro steps and is set up for one eighth increment uh, steps. The motor is a stepper motor, 12 volt DC, uh, two phase stepper motor and is similar to what you'd find in electronic uh, expansion valve uh, control. The LCD displays the uh, pressure, uh, evaporator exit pressure, the calculated superheat target temperature, and the evaporator exit temperature. The software is implemented in PIC Basic and is used to implement, first of all, a measurement of the pressure transducer and then calculate the superheat target temperature. And you can see if the pressure changes here that the target superheat is changing also. Notice that the stepper motor is now running to correct the error between the superheat target temperature and the evaporator exit temperature. The superheat target temperature is calculated based on a curve on R134A uh, properties and uh, then added uh, 5 to 10 degrees in this example to uh, determine a superheat target temperature. The, um, the expansion valve controls refrigerant into the um, ex uh, evaporator and then the temperature changes according to the um, amount of energy that's being extracted from the air, t air into the, in the evaporator. Now you can see that the stepper motor is controlling where the temperatures are near equal. If there's a big error, you can see the evaporator controller uh, runs the stepper motor and then in the opposite direction if the temperature is above the superheat target value.